Hi, Anthony here with a tutorial on how to link your website to your YouTube channel. I had created an earlier tutorial a couple of years ago, so I decided to update it. In this video, I'm going to link a WordPress website as an example, so let me walk you through the process step by step. So step number one, you need to add your website to Google Search Console, or what used to be called Webmaster Tools. So go to this link, or do a Google search, or just check the link in the description section. So log into your Google Search Console account, and if this is the first time you're doing this, you can use your Gmail account or create one. As you can see, I've already added a few blogs to my Google Search Console. To add a new site, click on the Add a Property button, and in this dialog box, enter the URL of your website in this box and then click the Add button. You will then see this page, giving you several methods to verify your website. I personally prefer the alternate methods, and I'm going to use the HTML tag option. Once you choose this option, it will generate a unique meta tag that you need to insert into the head tag of your website. So we'll leave this page open because we will have to come back here and click this Verify button but don't click it right now. So in step number two, you need to add the meta tag into the head tag of your website. And one way to add the meta tag to your WordPress website is to use the Jetpack plugin. I've created a separate tutorial on how to install and activate Jetpack. So once you've installed and activated the Jetpack plugin, log into your WordPress website, and you'll see Jetpack in this section. Go to the Settings section, and then click on the Traffic tab. So once you're on the Traffic tab, just scroll down to the Site Verification section, and in the Google section, enter the meta tag from the Google Search Console. And finally, save the settings. Next, let's go back to the Google Search Console, and then click the Verify button. You'll get a confirmation that your ownership was successfully verified. As you can see, this is the website that I just added and verified. In step number three, you need to link the website to your YouTube account. You can use this URL to go directly to the advanced channel settings of your YouTube account, and then scroll down, and in this box, add your website URL. I've already gone through this process using another blog, so I don't need to do this again, because you can add multiple websites. And finally, make sure to save the changes. So once you've completed these steps, your website will be linked to your YouTube channel. And finally, you can use the YouTube end screens in your videos to place a clickable link. You would do this in the end screens and annotations section. Look for a separate tutorial on how to create clickable links in your YouTube videos. Well, hope you found this tutorial helpful. If you've got any questions, please leave them in the comment section. Thanks for watching.